excitement. Fireworks are certainly exciting for the folks, but not such a treat for pets. Animal shelters warn how dogs and cats can get scared and run away during this time of the year. Eyewitness News reporter Kristen Powers tells us how you can keep your pets safe this holiday weekend. Red, white, and we love it. But for pets, the sound of fireworks is terrifying. Animals don't understand holidays. All they understand is that there's explosions going on outside. Nick Cullen is the director of Kern County Animal Services. He says every year around the 4th of July, pets get spooked and run away. Historically, you know, animal shelters usually see an increase in intakes, um, animals coming in. And to keep your furry friends safe this 4th of July, here are some tips. First, don't bring them to the fireworks. If you can possibly be home with your animal, if you can't be home, have the animal with somebody who you trust. Um, and if all else fails, and you have to keep the dog inside. Make sure that they're in a cool, uh, lit place where it's safe for them. Um, they have access to fresh food and water, and there's nothing of value within uh, biting distance. You can also prepare before the fireworks shows. Make sure your animal, God forbid if it does get out, has current um, identification, whether that be a name tag, phone and uh, address on its collar, or a microchip. Microchips are so important. If your pet does go missing, your best bet is to go check the animal shelters in person. Nobody knows your animal like you. Don't trust a picture online. Go down, check the kennels yourselves. Social media is also a great tool. The Facebook page Pet Detectives is run by people at the shelter who want to help reunite you and your four-legged family member. Be vigilant, keep looking for your animal. In Bakersfield, I'm Kristen Powers, Eyewitness News.